Hi, I'm Dawn with K-Square Technologies. In this tech tip, we'll look at three ways to capture and share meeting notes in Microsoft OneNote. Number one, adding meeting details into OneNote. If you have a scheduled meeting in Microsoft Teams or Outlook, you can give your notes a more consistent appearance and provide a more complete record of your meetings by adding meeting details into OneNote. To do this in OneNote, first move to the section where you want to add the meeting notes. Next, from the Home tab of the ribbon, choose Meeting Details. From the menu, either pick a meeting that occurs today, or you have the option to choose a meeting from another day. And notice here how you can move through and navigate through the available meetings. So I'm going to pick this upcoming meeting here on our project review and insert the details. So if you're on a regular page in that section, then OneNote by default will create a new page. But here it's noticing that there already is a page with previous meeting details. What I'm going to do here then is create a new page rather than adding it to the existing meeting page. So notice how the meeting details can include the date and location, agenda, the topic, and the attendees. The nice thing to know is that you can freely add to or change or delete any part of the meeting details in OneNote without affecting the original meeting notice. For example, I could delete the names of the invited attendees who weren't at the meeting so I have a record of who attended. So let's say that Adele had to cancel last minute, I can simply delete that information. In addition, I can add notes about this meeting. Maybe these are some action items or bullets. And a bonus tip is that when you have these kinds of action items, you can either format them with to-do tags, which gives you the option to check them off, or in the Home tab, here is Outlook Task. I can actually make this a task for me and choose when I want to accomplish that or even choose custom for that. So this would actually show up as a task for me in Outlook. Option number two, using a OneNote template. Another way to capture meeting notes in OneNote is to start with a built-in template for that OneNote page. As before, we move to the section where you want to add the meeting notes. Next, choose Insert, Page Templates, and from this pane on the right-hand side, pick the category of templates that might make the most sense. It might simply be a blank template for different size of paper, but here I'll pick Business. And you can see that there's some preset options here. What about simple meeting notes too? Or project overview? Now these are created as individual new pages where you can add the content as it comes up. So we can put in attendees, action items, agenda, and other key information. I even have the option in this template to insert the meeting details just like I did before. So that would be another choice for me, as we did before, to go to Home, Meeting Details, and for instance, to pick this meeting. And number three, sharing your notes via email. To share meeting notes by email, simply move to that page, and from the Home tab, choose Email Page. You can also press the keyboard shortcut, Control-Shift-E. Now the contents of that OneNote page will be inserted into a new email message. Make any changes to the recipients and the subject that you want and send it on its way. Another option is to choose File Send. How will you use OneNote to save time creating and managing your meeting notes? In this case, Squared Tech Tip, you've seen how to save time and effort by using Microsoft OneNote to manage meeting notes. How can we help you to be more productive? Please reach out to us for IT services and consulting to support you with Microsoft Technologies. We look forward to working with you. Thanks for watching.